baby, si te busco Dime, baby, ¿qué piensas hacer? Yo, 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 what's good, our squad? Welcome back to Arsenal. We're going to upload a video every single Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Today, I'm pretty much exposing myself because all these Yeezy masks behind me, well, I'm going to go ahead and say it right now, they are fake. They're all made from fake Yeezys. And I'm pretty sure some of you guys could assume that by now. Some of you guys guessed that they were fake. Some of you guys thought that they were real. But I'm coming out right now and telling you guys that they are all fake. Every single one of them. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. They're real masks, obviously, but they were made from fake Yeezys. Now, don't click out of this video just yet because there's a reason why they're fake. There's a reason why I made all these and why I didn't make them out of real ones. Because first of all, all these are pretty much trials of the masks. I personally did not want to go ahead and get a real Yeezy mess up by accident and pretty much have to throw away that Yeezy because those are expensive and the reason I made all these fake also is because I wanted to perfect that art and cut up real ones eventually and actually sell them and that's pretty much what this video is about as well I will be selling Yeezy masks not these these are all just like for giveaways and just for me to keep and to have a template pretty much but I will be selling real ones beginning next year I want to start producing them I'm gonna start making them by hand over this winter break that I'm done with school finals are next week and after that I do have all my free time well, I'm going to New York first and then after after that, I'm gonna have my free time to actually start making masks. And I do have a few pairs of the Beluga 2.0s coming in. I do still have pairs of zebras coming in, but what I'm gonna start off by doing is I'm gonna sell them in order. So I'm gonna have Beluga mask first, zebra mask first, and then eventually, hopefully, I make enough profit to be able to buy these shoes again for resale, which yeah, I'm gonna have to do it fortunately. And then I'm gonna cut those shoes up and then make masks out of them as well. Oh, what I was also thinking is that I would take custom orders, but I don't wanna do that because I wanna give everybody the fair chance to be able to get the mask when they release. Cause I know a lot of you have been asking me for this. You guys have been going crazy like ridiculous amount of comments just asking me to sell them when can I buy them the, you guys have been DMing me emailing me just going crazy for these masks so I was like you know what it's about time it's almost been a year since I haven't sold one so I figured why not start producing them for you guys and not just for myself and giveaways so this video is pretty broad like I'm not being too specific on dates or times or any of that because I don't know yet exactly right now all I have is just the idea of selling them but that's why I made this video for you guys to tell me what you guys exactly want what masks you guys want me to release when you want me to release them how you guys want me to sell them I need you guys to help me out here because you guys are the ones that are asking for these so i need you guys to give me all those ideas i do have an idea of how i'm gonna do it like i'm thinking every single day of how i'm gonna release them and all that but in the end pretty much what you guys say is what's pretty much gonna go like i'm probably gonna twist up the idea a little bit but what you guys say is what i'm gonna follow for the most part one more thing i did want to say about the mask is that they are going to be strictly handmade all these right here in my right hand are all made by machine and this one right here in particular is made by hand i made this last night and i realized that making it by hand made the mask look a lot neater it looks a lot more even it doesn't look crooked it doesn't have any bumps nothing's uneven which will make them cost more but you are getting a good quality mask like if you look at this zebra mask it looks very bumpy and if i open it this way it's uneven which i'm not too happy with i would not be happy selling this to you guys and on top of that i want to find a way to deliver this as well really nice presentation like i said presentation is huge for me if you guys seen my reviews i always talk about the way companies deliver their products because that much shows how much nicer the products are and i'm gonna find a way to deliver this with some pretty cool packaging or something i'm not just gonna ship this to you in a bag that's how i did the giveaways but now when i sell them to you guys i'm gonna make them with really nice presentation probably maybe a Yeezy box or something. I don't know yet exactly. We'll figure that out later. If you guys want to drop your ideas down below of how you guys want to see these being delivered, like I said, let me know down in the comments below. Anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for today. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Anyways, today's fan of the day does go to my boy, Mark Hibby, and it's funny because he commented on my YouTube video, and he's like, this kid needs to hit the gym. And then one of you guys, Curtis Warren, actually know who you are. Not personally, but you always comment on my videos, and I recognize the name. He's like, and you need to find a better barber. What type of whack-ass haircut? And it's funny because I'm his barber, but I did not cut that haircut in his pictures. Anyways, I'll see you guys on the next one. Make sure you stay woke. It's your boy. Yeah, yeah.